The hotel approval at Funnel Bay in the Whitsundays is a game changer. I'm Annette Harm, CEO of PRD Nationwide Whitsunday, and I'm here today to talk about the real estate market in the area throughout August, as well as the exciting hotel approval. So talking about sales, I'm here today at the beautiful, you can see the pool behind me, 48 Tropic Road, which we currently have listed. This property is for sale in one of the most active segments of the market at the moment. In the first half of 2019, with 36% of the sales, we saw the four to $500,000 bracket. Hardly surprising given that we are here in Cannonvale and that is the bread and butter segment of the market. Units, the trend there, was below 200,000, seeing 37% of the sales in the first half of the year. Not only are we seeing a lot of activity in the housing section in Cannonvale, we're also seeing a lot of properties being snapped up within seven days of coming on the market. How do we do this? We have a pool of buyers that we're already working with who are in our database that we're speaking with all the time and we're matching them to properties as soon as they come on. This means we're doing an off-market deal, meaning we're providing the maximum return possible to the seller in the shortest amount of time without having to spend any marketing. Moving on to the rental market. We're seeing fairly steady rates as far as the weekly rents in both houses and units. The one trend that we are seeing though is that the market is tightening. The first half of the year, the average vacancy rate was 3.6%. But in our office over the last month, we have seen this fall to below 2%. This does mean the market is tightening and we may see prices start to creep up a little bit as this happens. So the Whitsunday is in August, what does that mean? Well, to everyone who's in the know, it means sailing season. So we've enjoyed a very, very successful Airlie Beach Race Week with over 100 boats registered to race and Hamilton Island Race Week as well with somewhere in the vicinity of 250 boats there. It is the largest offshore regatta in the Southern Hemisphere. With Race Week comes the beautiful August trade winds and from after that, we have the school holidays also on our doorstep, which is a welcome relief for local tourism industry who've been doing it a little bit tough this year. So on that note, here is a wonderful announcement about the Funnel Bay Hotel. Hi, and welcome to Funnel Bay, like nowhere else on earth. We're down here today to celebrate the successful approval yesterday by the Whitsunday Regional Council of the 140 room hotel to be built out on the point here. The hotel is to be built by the Wellsmart Group, who have numerous holdings throughout Australia in Sydney, Melbourne, locally here in Cannonvale at Club Croc, and also in Queenstown, New Zealand. The hotel is due to begin construction as early as the end of this year. During the construction period, this is going to bring up to 150 jobs to town for locals, and once open, about another 100 for ongoing employees. This can only mean great things for our local economy. In addition to that, the capacity that's going to be brought about by these 140 rooms and all of the other things that go along with the resort means that we can bring more people to town without having a direct impact on the main street of Ellie Beach. It means great things for our economy and for our tourism industry that's been doing it a little bit tough over the past couple of years. Funnel Bay with the addition of the hotel will be complete. Taken from 2015 through to now, back in 2015, it was simply just a vacant block of land. A group of passionate local investors banded together to purchase the site and have gone on to develop the beautiful million dollar homes and blocks of land that you see down on the beach through to the more affordable homes being built directly behind me here. And then now with the completion of the hotel, it's truly brought the whole entire project together and the vision that the original buyers had. So we, we are super excited about what this means for the local economy and for the local residents here, as well as all of the visitors that we're able to welcome to town.